it's nothing. <laughs> um, we also have one obstacle here, which is a cow. So we're going to try and avoid him as much as possible, or her even. Um, and also we don't have the GoPro or the camera today, so we're filming it on my phone. So I'm sorry if the quality isn't as perfect as normal, but it's still 4K, which is good. So yeah, let's go. I'm going to start on some manuals. I just realised that I'm going to be going uphill, so I think I need to go the other way. Um, me or Harry both can't do manuals or wheelies, so I'm kind of just going off YouTube videos that I've watched before <laughs> and some tips Harry has in his mind that I can't do <laughs> his body. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to give it a go, see how it goes. What's that one we were talking about earlier? It's like you sit into the seat and then you push back. And yeah, you create an L. L shape with your body. Yeah. L shape with your body. Yeah. So go down and back. Okay. So go uphill or downhill? Probably downhill. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do that again, but roll faster. Yeah, I'm going to roll faster than that. Else? Yep. I don't know how to go. <laughs> I mean, there's only been a couple of attempts, but... Oh, it's just really scary. How long are you meant to hold it for? As long as you can, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do a wheelie instead. I think I'm better at those. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> okay, I got that. Let me go again. Your face. <laughs> it's nearly that, just lean back a bit more. And then if you go too far back, you use your back brakes, so you don't. Um, yeah. What's the word? Loop out. That's it, that's good. Oh. <laughs> that's good. Oh my god. That felt well good. I felt that point as well. Yeah. Like, you can go down and put it down. That's good. When I went to that point, it feels really high up. It's like, you feel like you're almost going to fall. <laughs> that was a good one. So today is day two. <laughs> I was just slipping the chain loop. Um, so today is day two and we changed location just because yesterday was so windy and I wasn't getting that far with the wheelies and manuals. So um, we have come to my favourite wood location um, and it's, it's local again. And you've seen quite a few videos here where there's been like a few jumps, but unfortunately they have all been destroyed. So we're just gonna do some like trails, um, travel a bit of distance today, maybe a bit more. Harry just shook his head. Um, <laughs> but more so like downhill and it's very loamy here and it's just rained. So it's gonna be pretty good to be fair, nice and grippy. Um, it's been really dry the past couple of days. So it's actually kind of nice and it's just got that fresh smell too. Um, are you excited? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put you on the chair, Steve. Don't know why I said it like that. Just came out. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put you on the chair, Steve. I'm gonna do one of my favourite runs, which is literally down there. <laughs> Let's go. So on our way. Whoa. Definitely <laughs> more grown than last time. Bumpy already. <laughs> so many roots. Oh, My legs are knackered already. <laughs> okay. 
Harry's currently clearing the path down there because where the, all the trees have been cut down, it's just loads of twigs on the track. So luckily we didn't go down there full speed. Would have had uh, a twig stuck in our spokes, but yeah. Um, I think we're gonna give this little run a go though, because it's actually really fun. You can't really see how steep it is, but you sort of start from here, come around this bam, whoa, nearly fell. And then off this like little drop here, can't really see it. And then down, loop round, and it actually runs really fast. So yeah. Oh. Oh, that's tight. <laughs> So Harry's just going to film from the side the little run we just did on the chesty just then. As you can see, come from up there, off the little drop, and then just stop there. I'm going to go again from a different angle. A bit of Shrek swamp here. There's a tree over there that's like split in half, you can see it. But look at this. Although that's like pure bog, it's actually kind of like beautiful, isn't it? I feel like this blog is slowly becoming like a nature documentary. <laughs> and we notice this. Wow. Wow, I've never seen that before. Wow, look at that. So we just came across all of this. That's crazy because so many of like the trails we'd normally go through are like completely changed now. Whoa. For example, that wasn't there before. That massive gap in the middle of the tree is obviously where, what are they called? Those, machinery. like yeah, all the like machinery come through. So, we went to some of the old bits that we used to bike at that we thought were destroyed and they are pretty much destroyed still. Um, but there's some still like leftovers <laughs> almost from them. Um, and there was this one jump that I wanted to hit for so long, but we just didn't come back. And it's actually pretty scary and it is a gap. So I'll show you it from the side. So this is the um, lip, so that's the run up. So you're off that and then you're just gapping that. So from there to there. It used to be a lot bigger, I think, like a lot higher. So I think that's why I'm not as scared. Um, but it's still quite a gap, so let's go. Ready? Oh, I did it! Okay. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. felt really fine like I've looked at that for ages and not wanted to do it just because there's a gap there and I've never really sort of ridden off trees so that was a really good experience and yeah it gave me a lot of confidence to maybe perhaps try some more gaps at like Twisted Oaks or Phoenix that hopefully I'll be hitting soon. <laughs>
Whoa, is that Prince Charming? <laughs> um, Shrek. Yeah, Shrek. Um, yeah, let's go. So you'll probably recognize where we are. Back to one of my first ever gap practices. Um, I'll show you from here. Can't really see it. Harry, go stand in the middle of it. <laughs> So this is where I actually first started practicing gaps. Thank you for the demonstration. <laughs> um, and like you run up from there and then up and off. You know what I mean? That's the run up. <laughs> you don't run. But it looks like this person has run, ran. No, they're not. Look, that's a footprint. Someone's ran and jumped it. That's not a paw. That is a shoe. Um, yeah, I'm going to give it a go and Harry's going to film from the side. Clear that to be honest, but it was really smooth. With it, you did it easy though. I was in the wrong gear to be honest. I put like two pedals in, but you probably could just roll, roll it. it, yeah. But, um, cool. Harry's about to hit this drop, which is this. So you come off that from up there. Here he comes now. Jesus! What reaction? What happened there? <laughs> Went a bit too yeah, quick. Quite too fast. I mean, yeah, he like landed here, and like <laughs> he's going off from up there. Literally there, that's huge. Oh yeah. <laughs> this table, which is just next to the gap, um, and you can't really see it from here, but it's from there to there. Harry's gonna stand on the side for me, so you guys can see if I'm clearing it or not, because it feels like I am, but we'll see, we'll see. What the f what a lot of that. <laughs> So fortunately that is the end of the video, but today has been so so good. I haven't ridden here in such a long time. Um just because again it got sort of destroyed, but we found a few older things. I'm so out of breath right now, just recovering from that run. Um, but yeah, to wrap up this video, just want to say thank you guys for watching. Please leave some comments, like, and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time.